in this church, if you go back through the parish records, between 1919 and 1935, this church provided a hot meal every day for the poor and needy of the parish. And the parish records say they stopped in 1935 because it was no longer needed, there being no more poor in the parish. So to have to open a food bank here in 2013 in the seventh richest country in the world, that makes me very angry. The fact that people are hungry, that's what brings, us, brings them to us. But we want to look at why they're hungry. And so we set out to provide a hub to provide community outreach services to them. But above all, it was about trying to give people back some dignity because the hardest thing for people to do is to walk through the back door of this church and say, I'm hungry, I need you to give me some food. My name is Akbar Korwani and I came from Iran. Yes, I'm working for Food Bank four days a week and I'll do everything for Food Bank. Last week we have we had 220 people. They are from asylum seekers and um, some homeless, some uh, they don't have any money. We help them. Um, I like Liverpool and I like living here. No, it's very good job. <laughs> How many people who walk down our streets that are hungry? And how many people do I pass each day who are lonely? And when night falls, how many people haven't a pillow to lie on? How many people feel sadness? Haven't a shoulder to cry on How many children unloved and abused Just want someone to love them And how many old folk who live on their own Just want someone to call on them How many people in pain Find comfort when someone is near them how many people who cry out for help Wish that someone could hear them How many people just need other people To treat them like people should be How many people like you People like me How many people just need other people to treat them like people should be? And aren't they just people like you and people like me?